I am preparing to dig a water well with that auger right there, handheld auger, and um, this bit down here. It's a six inch auger bit. And I'm gonna do this using some um, piping. This is one and a quarter inch, which should fit right on top of the auger bit. I have to get another bolt for that. And then I'm gonna step down to a one inch pipe. See how I ground this off first, and then I drilled a hole so I can put my bolt in there. Now that bolt will, um, on the small pipe will connect here on the auger. And that's why I needed this smaller pipe. So I drilled a hole here too. Um, of course I ground off some to make it flat. That made it easier to drill. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, so I don't know if this is gonna work. I don't know if we're gonna hit water, but I don't know if I'll show you this video either, but I, I dug three test holes, one in the ditch over here, one in the ditch, uh, down the hill and one even just a little bit further I couldn't even go two inches up here the clay was so hard this is end of August it's the driest time of the year here in Missouri and um, it's the best time to dig it's also on the flip side of that it's uh, really hard <laughs> really hard clay here you see all this is clay but down at the bottom of the hill there I uh, found a spot in the ditch where it took, in like one minute, I, I went down like two and a half feet because it was so soft. A um, little bit of sand mixed in. So I'm going to get a hole close to that area. I already went down um, about three feet with just the auger. And I'm going to use these pipes as extensions. And I don't even know if I have the strength to do this, but the plan is to go ahead and um, attach these pipes together and go deeper and deeper until I can't pull up any further or if I uh, if I hit some some water and then I'll probably drop maybe a four inch uh, thin wall um, PVC pipe and then um, go from there so that's uh, the plan we'll I'll catch you up on when I get started here 